Hi everyone, it's been a long time since I updated anything. That's for a few reasons. Uh, the first reason is I um, just needed a break. Sometimes I think pandas and pans is so overwhelming and it became my whole life. Um, and I want it to be part of my life and not take over my life. Um, so I step back from things. Uh, another reason is because unfortunately, uh, five rounds of IVIG, uh, and we saw no success with Jace and that was really devastating. Um, it took a long time to get over that. I don't think I'm still over it. Um, so we are back to trying different meds. Um, he is at a manageable level because of some new meds that we've put him on. Uh, he's taking Risperidone. Uh, it's an antipsychotic and it just has helped dramatically with his aggression. Um, so even when he's in a flare, I can tell he's in a flare, but he just isn't as aggressive, which just makes our day-to-day -day life so much more manageable. Um, the second thing that we put him on is um, clonidine that he takes at night. Uh, it helps him sleep and it also helps a little bit with his OCD. Uh, he's on a very low dose right now, so it's not like a dramatic difference. When we've gone to upper doses, uh, it kind of puts him in a brain fog and I don't like it. And so uh, we're just keeping him a low dose mainly to help with sleep and just a little bit with OCD so it's not so consuming. Um, but other than that, uh, cold and flu season's been kind of the typical, usual cold and flu season where we're on and off antibiotics and in and out of flares, you know, every few weeks. So, um, but thankfully for those meds, it's been manageable. Um, I think the biggest, um, thing that has happened uh, and which is why I'm updating right now is um, most parents that have a child with pans or pandas can pretty much pinpoint um, the month, the week, or even the day that their child had their onset. Um, I can, I can narrow, it, narrow it down to a month. I didn't know what pandas or pans was at the time and Jace was so young. Um, that when he started having fits and tantrums um, before he was two, you know, it seemed age appropriate. So I can't necessarily pinpoint the week or the day. But this time around, Jace's little brother, Ashton, who will be two uh, on May 9th, um, I can pretty much tell you that he's had his onset this month. And today it's like official in my mind that he has pans. Um, for the last two months, he's been on and off different antibiotics for strep that just we can't get rid of. Um, he started a blinking tick, which was the first thing that we saw in Jace. And by the way, Jace was his exact same age when he had his onset. Um, and just in the last couple days, he hasn't been sleeping well. And he has started having just these major meltdown tantrums that last for hours and hours and nothing will make him happy. Nothing will calm him down. Um, and he's still having his blinking tick. So, um, I just, <sighs> this is so hard because I know what this means and I know what the next you know, a few years of our life is going to be like, and it sucks. It sucks that I'm doing it all over again and I'm living it all over again with another child. I have thought um, so many times that when Jace had his onset and we didn't know what it was, you know, that six months to a year was just the worst time in my whole life. Um, not knowing what to do, not knowing how to help him and just struggling, you know, every single day. And I never 
would wish that on anybody. I would, you know, it's just, it's awful watching your kid disappear. Ashton has been just the happiest, sweetest little boy. Everyone comments on just how sweet and happy he is. And uh, he's, it's like he's just gone now. And now I have this little baby that just, every time I pick him up, he thrashes around and hits me and headbutts me and just his happiness is gone. So today is that day. Today is the day that I can say that Ashton has pans or pandas. Um, he has strep right now, so uh, it could just be pandas, hopefully. Um, so anyway, I just wanted to uh, get back on and give everyone a, a quick update. Um, I'll start updating this probably a little bit more. Um, maybe not as much as I did last year when I started it, um, but I'll try to update a little bit more. Um, thank you for watching and for all those that have reached out to me and, and asked me questions. I hope that I've been able to help. Um, you know, that's my purpose in doing this is so that someone that's looking at this for the first time and saying, is this what my kid has? Um, I want you to be able to see what it looks like um, so you can compare and know that you're not alone in this, that other kids have this, other moms are going through this, other dads are going through this, grandparents. Um, so anyway, thanks. Ashton? Ashton, do you want a baba? Ashton, do, do you want a baba? Should we go in the car? Do you want to go bye-bye? Should we go in the car?